Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to install performancing ads onto your blog. I've been getting quite a few emails about this, so this screencast will show you step by step how to do it. The first thing you have to do is log into your performancing ads control panel and find your site. If you don't have a site yet, then you need to click add a site and add your blog to the system. So, you know, it's pretty so pretty self-explanatory. Enter your name, your site URL, site description, a few tags, what categories you belong to, and then hit done, and that'll create the site into the system. After you create the site, the next thing you gotta do is add a region. A region tells performance and ad where the where the ads are. All right. So let's do that right now using my daughter's blog as an example. We're gonna add a region for her. Okay, this is the uh, region for my daughter's blog. See, I said sallychow.com. The region name is the right sidebar. I'm gonna have one ad across, four ads down. Price is $10 per week. No follow, hmm, that's only if you're scared of Google. A filter is basically if you want to exclude some sites from advertising on your blog, like, you know, if you don't want shoe money to advertise on there, I would just put down shoemoney.com. And then shoe can never buy an ad on my daughter's blog. The margin between ads, please self explanatory from one pixel to 10 pixel. When you're ready to go, just hit done. And now the region is created. And take note of this right here. The region code 918. Now, after you created the region, next thing you gotta do is download the software. Now, this software is actually universal. I mean, it doesn't matter how many regions you create, you just download it. After it's been downloaded, you just unzip it, upload it to your server, and then you just go to your blog. Go to plugins. Here's the performancing ads plugin. Activate it. After that, go to your designs. Go to your widgets. See the nice thing about the performancing ads plugin is that it's widget friendly. Here it is right there. Add it, add it over to the sidebar. Click edit and give it a title. In this case, I call it a sponsor. The region ID, this is where you actually go back to your region on your blog. And you know right there, there's your region ID. In this case, it's 918. Every time you make a new uh, region, you'll get a new number. So just remember that number, it's 918. So 918. So there you go, save that. And I guess I want the, uh, the ad to show up on top right there. Save changes. Okay, now let's go to my daughter's blog. This is the current blog right now. And if you hit refresh, there you go. Those are the ads. Easy.